Buenos dias. Today we are going to settle the bien versus bueno. Huge thing that I've been yelling about since forever. The big contest. Well versus good. The reason why you cannot use bien for when you mean good is because bien is an adverb and bueno is an adjective. So when you say estoy bien, you are not saying I'm good. In English, we say I'm good. In Spanish, you say I'm well. Technically, in English, we should say I'm well as well because we are not using proper grammar. Adverbs describe verbs. Adjectives describe nouns. For example, juego baloncesto bien. I play basketball well. Well is describing how you play. Nado bien. I swim well. You are describing how you swim. Escribo bien. I write well. Versus, es estudiante bueno. It's a good student. Or he's a good student. Tengo la comida buena. It's good food. So how do you clarify how you do something in Spanish, or how you did something, or how you used to do something, or how you are doing something, or how you just did something, or how you're going to do something? Well, you use adverbs. Very, very simple. How do you take activo, a noun, or an adjective, like you can say, I'm a person that's active, una persona activa, or you can say, that's an active boy, un chico activo. How do we make it? I do this actively, activamente. Easy, the adjectives, becomes facilmente, easily, the adverb. I do this easily. Frequente, frequent. How do you make frequent into frequently? Frequentemente. Lento, slow, into slowly, lentamente. If you note, if something ends in an E, like frequente, we just added a mente. If it ends in an O, we go lentamente. Perezosamente, lazily. Rapidamente, rapidly. So, she's a quick girl, es una chica rapida, like she is fast, versus she runs fast, you'd say, Corre rapidamente, because this is your adverb. Sano, healthy, healthily, sanamente, you want to eat healthily. Seria, seriamente, you do this seriously. Tranquilo, you are a calm person, una persona tranquila, tranquilamente, you do this tranquilly. Triste, the adjective sad, becomes sadly, tristemente. So let's see if we can take some sentences and add in some adverbs to describe how we do activities. I played on a team. Well, I played on a team activamente. Porque soy persona activa. So you play actively because you are active. There's the adjective. There's the adverb. Hice ejercicio. Oh, well, I did exercise lentamente or tranquilamente. Or maybe you really don't want to do it, so you did it sadly. We scored a goal contentamente, happily. We competed in the championship, maybe easily, because we're really good. Corrí en la pista rápidamente. Or maybe I ran intelligently, inteligentemente. I slept well. Maybe you wanted to say, oh, I had a good sleep. I slept well. Or... Perezosamente, lazily, can you sleep? We were tied difficilmente, we tied difficultly. I lied, hopefully easily, or difficultly. 
not facilmente. Maybe we can just change that. I didn't lie easily. You know, you shouldn't lie easily. I practice yoga tranquilamente. But you could do this to any adjective. Can you um, practica yoga obedientemente? Obediently? Comi sanamente. I eat healthy. So I hope you're ready to make some adjectives into adverbs and use adverbs to describe how you do actions, especially because you'll need it for the clicker games.